Hi and welcome to City Happenings. I'm Mayor David Black. Papillion continues to grow and offers much to its residents so they can live, work, and play. For more about Papillion, here's City Happenings. Thanks, Mayor Black. The annual holiday luncheon is set for Saturday, December 2nd. This is different than other events sponsored by the Papillion Community Foundation. The holiday luncheon has been around for a long time. It's a Papillion tradition. You know, like you said, it started as the old German Christmas luncheon. So, um, and it's an intimate kind of setting. So it's indoors um, and it has this like this appeal to it because the tables are all distinctly decorated differently. And just to come in and look at those tables and how people have taken the details of, of, of putting those tables together um, is amazing. That, that makes the event. The holiday luncheon continues its tradition. We have a raffle, we have an oral auction um, that, that helps us raise money that goes towards funding Winter Wonderland, because Winter Wonderland is not a cheap process, <laughs> it's not a cheap event to put on, and we, it is free to the public. The only thing the public pays for is the chili feed. Of course, you can't have a luncheon without food. We have a beautiful menu, that's, it's a catered lunch, salad, heavy salad lunch, uh, it's, it's got a wonderful, warm, you know, Christmas feel to it. It got, you know, it's a full full meal with dessert and and everything is hand served by your table sponsor, which is really kind of neat. Um, you know, we are we take a room that is typically a gymnasium and we transform it into into this beautiful winter you know winter holiday kind of feel to it. So we take a a 24 foot feeling and we're ceiling and we're dropping it 12 feet with lights and fabric to make it, you know, really intimate. Papillion has a planning commission. It's a group of volunteer appointees who serve the city and is an advisory board to the city council. The builders or developers will present their ideas for development within the city to the planning department. The planning department then reviews those plans and presents a report to the commission, which we study and then have an opportunity for public feedback public questioning of the developer and the proposal at our monthly meetings. The Planning Commission meets once a month. We offer recommendations to the City Council about the appropriateness of the development, how it fits in with the master plan, how well it fits with adjacent uses, mm -hmm. and uh, we kind of offer a guiding hand to the future path of development in the city. The mayor appoints the commission members from people who volunteer. We have a pretty good demographic range in terms of age, in terms of gender. We have a number of uh, entrepreneurs, we have a number of folks who work in the city. Um, everyone must live in the city or within the extraterritorial zoning jurisdiction. That is a, a statutory requirement for membership on the Planning Commission. Being a public hearing, One function of the commission is acting as a conscience for both the Planning Department and City Council. We always try to entertain lively discussion amongst the commissioners. Um, sometimes we interrogate the developers and our own planning department as to what are the motivations for this? Why is this proposed in this way as opposed to looking like this? Or why are the buildings oriented this way? And were other options considered? The commission plays the role of the concerned citizen who might not have been able to attend the meeting or anticipate potential problems. We're interested in all aspects of any development from traffic impact, uh, to aesthetic appeal, mm -hmm. to the uses and their appeal uh, within the community. Papillion is now home to a new branch of the Nebraska Title Company. I just want to thank everyone for coming and celebrating with us today on the opening of our beautiful new office. We are very, very excited to be here, so excited for a great future here, so thank you. I just want to say welcome again. Uh, nice to be at the first ribbon cutting, and it's always nice to be at one where business is expanding. And uh, you guys have like you guys got great visibility here. I mean, before you were next to the popcorn shop, no better, but nobody knew you were <laughs> yeah. down there. Um, so this is just a great spot. But uh, excited about a title company being here. Just telling somebody else, I think last month we had record housing starts um, in Papillion. It's like each month we have record housing starts. We got like 1,500 lots in the platting process. Um, and so in the entire metro, it's one of the fastest growing, so great for transactions. 
um, on the commercial side. I know you probably don't do a lot of commercial here, but um, you guys are into it. A um, lot of industrial manufacturing. Just pulled a building permit today for 250,000 square foot industrial building. We got about a million square feet in the works. A um, lot of transactions for you guys, and you're actually from a time travel perspective in the middle of the Omaha Lincoln Metro area, right here. So, not a better spot to be. So, thank you and welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Yay! That's what's happening around Papillion. There are lots of ways to stay up to date with what's happening. You can find us on Facebook, follow the City of Papillion on Twitter, or even watch our YouTube channel. And of course, information about all of our departments and programs is available on our website, www.papillion.org. For more information, go to papillion.org or just call the Mayor's Hotline at 402-827-1111. Thanks for watching.